excellent parking job, if I do say so myself. Welcome back, everybody. We are here with Amita doing the last however many missions we have to do. I, uh, I didn't really do any side mission-y stuff Where since last time. At the Kalesh. We're getting ready for the final push. This is it. Win or lose. The ball is splitting the golden path. He's jeopardizing our future, Ajay. Enough is enough. Are you asking me to? I'm telling you to kill him. I'm being very particular with my words, Ajay. Don't let him snake out of this. Besides, did you really think he was going to be okay with you betraying him and siding with me? No. We can't afford to let Sabal live. Ajay, be careful. The Golden Path needs you. I need you. Inevitable, shocking plot twist. Who didn't see this coming? Seriously, who didn't see this coming? I, uh, I expect some sort of emotional standoff of like, Oh, why, brother? Why? I was doing it for my people and all that stuff. But, uh, Amita and Sabal are both kind of dickholes, so I'm not really too broken up about it. Oh, RJ, I can almost see your furrowed brow from here. Megan, what do you want? I'm nearly calling to check up on you. I hear your little friends are having a bit of a spat. It must be hard. What with you in the middle of it all? Choices are difficult. Trust me, I've been there. In fact, you should be grateful for the choices I've made. Choices like Yuma. I went on live television to serve her up to you, and I knew television. Radio is so much more my thing. And you, oh, you jumped on the opportunity. Poor human, she will be missed. It was a tough call to make, picking you over her. But it was the right call. We'll see. Of course, you're in a hurry. Places to go, shit to tear up. <laughs> I'll let you get back to it. But don't forget, RJ. Choices have consequences. I choose to... Kill the crap out of that tiger. Okay, so yeah, choices, consequences, that's kind of a universal thing. It's not exactly Again, revelatory. No, I did not make this decision lightly. Sabal will never give up on his beliefs. And if he's allowed to live, it will only be a matter of time before he starts an insurgency of his own. Killing him will help to unify the Golden Path and prevent a second civil war from breaking out moments after we end our current struggle against Pagan. This is what's right for Kirat. When the time comes to pull the trigger, I trust you'll make the right decision. Uh, yeah? Wait, what now? That's... oh, okay then. So apparently I'm going to be able to... not kill him, I guess. You're kind of ruining the whole thing for me here. It's... it's very... <laughs> it's... You're, 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 you're showing your cards before you uh, deal the hand here, so to speak. That doesn't really make sense, but... The, uh, I think the sentiment holds true. Maybe I'm just seeing through it for some reason. I don't know. Alrighty then. Metaphorical stairs. Well, figurative. Literal stairs. Literal stairs. Stairs have meaning in a symbolic sense. I'm rambling here. I'm just trying to get here. See, he's not going to be here. This is... That hang glider tells me he's not going to be here. Oh, hey, Sabal's here. I can be wrong. Did 
that she sent your brother? Did you volunteer? What do you think you're doing? You shit on everything your father built. Congratulations. Everything that meant something is irrelevant thanks to you. And that's what's truly sad, brother. You handed over everything to a meter. To a meter. You think she can fix Kirad? How? Drug fields as far as the eye can see. Suicide nets in factory towns where men, women, and children are free to be poor? It's a land of equal opportunity where everyone's a slave. Do you think this is the country your mother wanted her ashes to be scattered in? So what's it going to be, brother? I'm going to shoot you. I get that pistol from well I wasn't expecting it to be that uh, abrupt I took care of Sabal I can't believe it I'm sorry RJ it, it had to be done and that doesn't make it any easier does it There'll be time to deal with this later. Right now, we have a country to save. Well, okay. Yeah, both of these jerk holes are kind of jerk holes. I've said it before, I'll say it again. If I could, uh... If I could shoot both of them, I would. I really hate how, you'll notice how there's no... Oh, there it is. Never mind. I don't know if I was just missing it, but... I've noticed that somehow the main objective markers don't show up on the map while you have a notification on screen. It's really kind of silly. Anyways, since uh, it took us a... we were rather efficient time-wise shooting Sabal in the face. So I'm gonna fly over to the next mission and then we'll start that one too. Maybe we'll get two done in one video. Two missions, one video, dot com. I'm gonna cut out the flying. Thank you for flying Curat Airways. We are on our final approach to the last, uh, I think we're down to the last two or three missions. I'm not entirely positive. I'd have to open the menu to check. The I see blue trucks, so that means we're not flying into enemy territory here. We're not even in a mission anyway. I don't know why. Ugh, exit. That's fine. Why would you do that? Uh, well, I, I wasn't expecting to have to justify my answer here. How are you doing, Ajay? I'm doing fine, you know. I just killed a friend, quote unquote. Hello. Ajay, we've been waiting for you. Everybody is rallying for one final push. We're hitting Fagan's fortress. It won't be easy. I heard about Sabal. Whatever you're feeling, just know that Amita only wants what's best for Kira. Yeah, okay. 
We have to get going. Okay, well, you're all right. All right. Wow, this is straight up cavalry here. I really should have switched out my weapons. Dang it, I did it again. At least I have ammo and health stuff this time. I just forgot to change my one my one gun. Should we go by air or by land? Uh, it's 700 meters away. I don't want to deal with roads and traffic. That mid-morning Kirat traffic. Don't want to deal with it. I kind of wish there were other people in um, other flyers behind me. Then we can play like Flight of the Valkyries. Dun 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 dun. dun, dun. So we're attacking the fortress before we've um, weakened it, which is different. I haven't done that before. You guys lead the charge. Oh, you guys are so dead. Um. Oh. Hello. RPG went right by my face. Oh dear god, can I just kill you or what? Alright, mortars... mortars first. Because they are... They're bad. Of all the bad things here... They're one of the worst. Okay, machine gun nest. Down! Oh hey! And you're dead. Right by your buddy. Relatively. Uh, someone... I still don't have herbs for my cheaty syringe. Seriously? These guys are just sauntering around, way too cavalier. There we go. Oh, there's a guy there that I didn't see. There's a guy up there I didn't see. And there's a guy up here I didn't see, apparently. Stand that ground. Stand it. There's a lot of guys just right clumped up here somewhere. There we go. That worked out well. Okay, you stay here, blue guy. I'm gonna go... Alright, he's up there somewhere. I wasn't sure... Oh, that sounds bad. He's still alive. Let's just miss 11 times. Where... Are you getting shot at from? Okay, I'm trying to clear out the guys behind me, because that's never a good thing, but screw it. I don't want to deal with that anymore. Let's... Should we, like, follow the blue crowd and go up the road? This seems Darwinistically a bad idea. Okay, yeah, there's a gate. I don't know where that guy is. I see the red blip on the map, but he's... He's gone. I don't know where he is. Surprise! Um... Okay, they, they got in somehow.
There we go. There we go. I wish I got this earlier, this auto crossbow. It's fun. Okay, where where is this guy that's shooting me? I I'm already in. Uh, I guess I have to let everyone else in. Okay, let's do this. Stand away from the gate. I'm warning you. That guy just straight up died. I can't help it if you people are derpy. There's an enemy in there somewhere. Ah, oh, there he is. I'm on fire. There we go. Um... Gate is breached. Oh, that sounds alarms. Alarms bad. Can I like climb up on the side? No, I cannot. Okay, interesting. This is a different setup than before. Uh. Are you all dead? I don't know how that works. Ow, ooh, ow, ooh. Almost dead. Gee whiz! Did that AI person say you have such nice skin? That's really awkward, different, inappropriate, inappropriate. How do I? <laughs> I just I just sit here and capture it. Oh, you're gonna die! I warned you. Oh, you're gonna die too. I warned you. We have the I guess I can't call in my gun for hire here. Okay, can I? I don't, I can't. I have no, I really should have brought an RPG or something. They've, uh, they've really upped the usage of helicopters in the last half of the game here. Oh dear God. <laughs> Jesus. Freaking thing dropped right on top of me. Okay, let's go get this one. I don't know where you are. Guy, red dot thingy. There you are. I still can't use my gun for hire thingies. Would have been helpful ten minutes ago. Molotovs everywhere. I'm sure to find something to replenish my supplies. Hopefully.
There's an awful lot of enemies down there. Oh, no! Get off the hell- Get off the ladder. Alright, out of ammo. I'm still gonna try calling in- Calling in my things. Uh, where's the last one? Last one's over there somewhere. This is gonna be a long video here. We have like a weird multi-staged mission thing going on. Uh, let's see here... Shotgun? Let's do this. I probably should have replaced the auto crossbow thing. It's instant death, but less useful here. All right, I'm here. Oh, hello. Good lord. Came out of nowhere. I didn't kill an ally, did I? My bad. Where are these people coming from? Are they coming through here? Oh, hey, they are. Done. We've taken everything. Nope, no zipline for you. Looks fun though. How did you- there we go. Onwards. Regroup with the golden path. Very well. I don't know how they would have gotten in front of me. Well, yeah, of course. Um, oh, is there like guns or something I can use? Probably up there. Yeah. Oh, I can't move. There we go. Oh, you're dead. Dying to something. Can't really tell what. I just want to make things explode. Oh, hey. There you are. don't see anybody else. I feel electric too. Nothing gets the, the blood pumping like killing 50 or 60 people. What are we waiting for? There's like one guy playing hide and seek. You get to die. Um, okay. Am I gonna have to like press E on this or can I just... There we go. Right on his ankle. You should not stand next to it, dummy. Is this thing seriously a gold statue? Really? How 
DJ? What do you have against my likeness? All those posters, Eric, my double, and now this. Am I missing a hint? Should I start taking this personally? That statue was solid fucking gold. Literally. I'm not being metaphorical. Do you know how many artifacts I had to melt down to get it made? And poor Eric standing there for God knows how long just to pose for it. Well, it's done, it's done. And dinner's nearly ready. <laughs> Amita, the gate's open. I'm heading for the palace. The royal guards counterattacking. We'll be there as soon as we can. I'm going after Pagan. Oh, listen to this music. That's gonna get a content ID on YouTube. All right, um, we're continuing on because it's continuing on. I may have to split this in half. Let's go. Look at that, no radio in the car when it's narratively appropriate. All right, Pagan Men, how do we want to kill this guy? Shotgun to the face, rocket launcher, Molotov, throwing knife, grenade. None of the above as we inevitably enter into some quick time event where we end up like stabbing him and pushing him off a building or something. Like from Die Hard, that's what I'm picturing in my mind. This music kind of reminds me of the the Truxican standoff in Good and Bad and Ugly. It is a <laughs> it is an appropriately long, uneventful drive leading up to it. Maybe that's what they were going for. Um, am I am I going the right way? It seems like it. Okay. Nice place you got here, bro. Let's blow it up. Knock, knock. I laugh at your door. Oh, I don't laugh at your door. Apologize for the austerity I sent to help home. Chances are you shot that on your way in. Now, before we begin, ah, to whom am I speaking? The son who returned to scatter his mother's ashes, or the lunatic who has murdered his way to the top of my mountain? If I was speaking to the first guy, then I would say, sit down. Let's be civilized. Enjoy some food. But we tried that before, didn't we? At our first meeting? You sat right here. Paul was off applying voltage to the nipples of your rude little plus one. I stood just like this. And what were my exact words? Ah, stay here. Enjoy the crab rangoon. Don't move. I'll be right back. Now, if you had just listened, just waited for me, then we would have come back here straight away together and scattered your mother's ashes. So then you must be the second guy who didn't listen, decided instead to join the other monkeys and start throwing his shit around. But I'll tell you what. <clears throat> I call a do-over. Hmm? I say you have two choices. One, you could shoot me, boring, or you could sit down and enjoy some food. And you and I will go scatter your mother's ashes.
boring. Well, now I'm curious what happens if I if I sit down and eat. All right. Appreciate the credits. I'm gonna skip. See if there's something else at the end of this. Hagen's dead. It's I, I can't believe we won. Did you find Lakshmana? No. I don't know what it is. It's not important. No. You're right. What matters now is rebuilding Kirat together. Well, and that is it, I guess. I... Eh. It was fun. I don't know. The story kind of really meandered. I was kind of expecting some, uh, what's the word, ceremoniously, you know, scattering of ashes and stuff, but I guess that was, uh, <laughs> it seems, <laughs> my final request, go scatter my ashes in Lakshmana. Ah, uh, it's not important. Oh, you're right. It's not important. These people are jerks. Everyone in this game is a jerk. <laughs> oh. Oh, hey, these guys still around. Hello, Dave. Oh, Mr. Gale. Well, I guess that's it then. No more mayhem and destruction. I need up the old rocket lodger. All right. I really love what you've done with the place. Uh, It'll be set. Here we go. Put it on the shelf, as it were. Gathering dust. Unless. <coughs> Some unfinished business, perhaps. Loose ends, isn't it? Or people to kill? That's why I just said, though. It's Yogi, you prat. Smoke? Smoke? Not this time. Seriously, do not turn your back on those people. They straight up drug you at every opportunity. I don't know what that means. It's probably relevant for something. All right, we are done. Far Cry is out. I am done. I had fun with it. Um, it's basically, you know, mechanically Far Cry 3. Bacon may be gone, but his fortress, Rajgad, still stands. The forces stationed there are in disarray without Bacon. You should press the attack and hit them while they're vulnerable. What? Seriously? Well, should we... Uh, should we... I mean, this probably doesn't do anything, right? I haven't even gotten all this stuff. I haven't even pushed that far in. Ah! We're done. We're done for realsies. I'm gonna go do it, though, but not recording it. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I don't know what's on the horizon in regards to videos and stuff. I, uh, I don't know if I'm gonna be doing another Let's Play for a while. Anyways, thanks for watching. Stick around. If you enjoyed it, let me know. Let me know if you like watching these things and, you know, maybe that will convince me to uh, play something else. So I'm going to end this video ceremoniously, as I have done many times before, wing gliding into the ground.